Today we're taking a look at the A variant of the Foxfire MBS motor housing. A is stands for assault and it tries to give Foxfire more of a rifle type uh, looking uh, setup on the front end. Um, so the first thing to note about uh, the A housing is that it is large enough and it's set up that you can run a four flywheel, a two stage flywheel setup. And I've got in here right now uh, an open flywheel project uh, for uh, uh, four flywheel um, cage setup that uh, setting up with cyclone wheels. I'm running Neo uh, Rhinos is my first stage. I'm running Michelle 2.0s, the second stage, all running off of a pretty beefy 3S LiPo. And so this housing gives you the ability to drop that open flywheel cage in here and have that four flywheel setup. Now, the same as with the uh, P variant, the pistol variant of the, um, of the housing, it also uses uh, a Strife Rapid Strike Screw Boss setup. And you can see there's only one, two, three, four screws holding this whole cage in here. So that means you can drop any cage. It doesn't have to be a four flywheel cage. You could drop a two flywheel. You take the uh, cage that I had in the, the P variant, take it out, drop it right in here and it would work beautifully. So the whole system is set up to use whatever aftermarket uh, cage that you want to put in here, whether it's an artifact, a BSP, an open flywheel project, any of those aftermarket cages will drop right in as long as they are designed with the Strife Rapid Strike uh, Screw Boss uh, ports in here. Now, you can also see with this, and one of the features that I didn't talk about on the, on the P variant, which it also has, is the extended depth of the housing on this side. And that is to allow for you to, to put 180 motors into the system. So you can run this off of 180s, you can run this off of 130s, 132. You really have the option to put whatever motor you want in here. Um, the barrel setup, it's a bit longer and it's got kind of a, a breacher kind of setup uh, look to it. It's running, it, it connects in with the same uh, slot ring setup as the P variant, it locks right down in here. And then you can see on uh, the housing that cut out, that locks it right into place. And when you put it together, it, it squeezes it right in and it holds it right there in place. The system uses the same hook slot setup. Let me move this over here so you can see it. Uh, the same hook and slot setup that uh, the other housings and the core does all the hook into the receiver. So it uses that same kind of setup when, with your screws coming in here. And I've got the whole thing wired up off of an, an XT60 connector, which you know, slides in and pulls the whole system together. So anyways, this is the A variant of the Foxfire motor housing. Thanks for watching.